Hi everyone, I'm Rob. Welcome to another episode of Beyond Beginners. So, this is a series of Rubik's Cube tutorials. It's designed for people who've just learnt the beginner's method and want to be a little bit more efficient in solving the cube. It's not really about speed cubing. You can go to other videos on the internet for that. This week, I'm gonna be talking about the top layer and an algorithm to make you a little bit more efficient about solving the corners. So as I say, today we'll be talking about the top layer. As you can see, I've already solved the yellow face. And the next stage, according to the beginner's method, is to solve these uh, corners, put them in the correct position. Usually, two of the pieces are already in the correct position. You can see that there's a matching green face on, on these two cubes here. So they're already in the correct position. And so you just have to perform an algorithm to swap these two pieces over, which I'll show to you now. And so every corner piece is in the correct position. That's the beginner's method. Sometimes, however, you get a situation like this where all the cubes are mixed up. None are adjacent to where they should be. And in fact, what you need to do is swap the cubes diagonally. And there is a special algorithm for that, which I'll show you now. So here we are. I hope it's clear what that means. It's an anti-clockwise turn on the left, followed by a clockwise turn on the top, an anti-clockwise turn on the right, and then a half turn on the top. Then you do a clockwise turn on the left, anti-clockwise on the top, clockwise on the right, and then you do the same procedure again. So you perform the same set of maneuvers twice. And these second line and fourth line are sort of the reverse of the third line and uh, first line and third line, which is uh, why I've sort of written out the algorithm like this. So you can see the very pleasing symmetry in it all. I'll show you how that looks on the cube. That's one of my favourite algorithms. I think the symmetry of it has a certain elegance. Anyway, that's it for this video. Uh, as always, please uh, leave comments and likes, thumbs up, or whatever below, and stay tuned. There will be more coming soon. Thank you.